Alright, hey everyone, welcome back to Hylix. The actual last episode. Last time we bought a spaceship and we fought the final boss. I really love red, black, and blue. It really reminds me of uh, Venom from the 1990s Spider Man cartoon. So I took a quick break to go do some laundry. Avenge line bad insect. Uh, yeah. Oh, whoops. Oh, there's everyone. <coughs> Oops. Uh, and I had to go pick my wife up from the bus stop. I mean, had to. I wanted to. I love her. I think I've read that one before. See, so it looks like the random generation of the uh, script is consistent. So it's just there's a bunch of like generic words, and they're all piece by piece replaced with certain things. So that's why we keep seeing insect, mandible, ocean, furnace. Okay. Uh, let's detonate the eerie statue. Oh, he doesn't have it. Shit. Dark flame, I guess. Um, yeah, you can protect everyone, I guess. Okay. Jesus. Oh, there goes. Oh. Oh. Okay. Um. Hmm. Let's try this. You partial destruct, yeah. Partial destruct is one of those things that's probably like better at the start of a fight than at the end. Right. Oh, cool. Perfect. Nice. Look at that. Oh, wow. Okay. Okay, so now we need to work on the other thing. Um, detonation's the best. Uh, yeah, you buff Wayne. Wayne has the most survivability of anyone. to use her I guess yeah just sure can it she's really fast which is useful Wayne go up waste your turn okay, and then the other attack okay well luckily some of already went cool so that's dead you and uh, burrito you oh shit well there goes another one oh and everyone's confused too 
Oh, that ain't good. Oh, Jesus. This is a, this is a big old cycle of hurting. Okay, well. That could have been a lot better. I want to get the chance to use this. Oh, boy. So it looks like when he attacks, he does so twice. Alright. Shit. Oh, shit. Can the deutoplasm bring someone back from the dead? That's gonna kill me. No, it won't. Well, not what I expected. Let's make the most of it then. God, he has a lot of health though. The fact that the heal also protects you is really useful. Because it basically guarantees... Oops. Okay, let's see here. That's all I have, huh? Sorry, I've been hitting my other microphone into my microphone. Puddle. Come on, get him up. Oh boy. Maybe this won't be as easy as I suspected. This is the first really big challenge, though. Let's see if I have some meat to drop off. Oh. That was stupid of me. Let's, uh, let's try it now, then. Right. The TV downstairs is detonation, right? Well, even if it is, not everyone has that. Oh yeah, and these things, like... Won't she kill them? Alright. No, it's not, damn it. So, when she does that, her mindiness is now 72. Let's see what I have here. Oh, cool. See, the issue with sinking all of them into Wayne is that whenever Wayne's dead, I'm not getting the bonus from all of those. However, that doesn't really matter. So I guess all of those things that I just like bulldozed through here, all of those counted as meat. I have no idea what the foods do. But that's the only right. That's the only way, the reason that I can think of as to uh, why I had so much meat without realizing it. Okay. Dark flame. Dark flame. Partial destruction, Gibby. And, uh, 
Space Shurikens, the Yuri statue. just starts. <laughs> I'm honestly confused as to what the hell is happening. Oh, well, we're all dead. Cosmic procession only hurts you for half your remaining, your current health. Okay. Let's hope that this lasts. Perfect. Yes, yes, I like that. Yes. We're getting full up. Oh, yeah. Okay. But luckily that won't hurt us. The flesh leech is annoying. but it won't affect us because of the statuses. So that was a... Oh, Mother Hubbard. All right. Dark Flame. Dark Flame. He doesn't have enough for partial destruction. Uh, space Shurikens. Get him, Han Gorma. Okay, we're now about to where he was before he was healed. Put that all on him. Perfect. Try this. While we're here, that fucking stock, like Game Boy image, it's so good. Oh, I hope this doesn't kill me. Okay, we survived. Helmet guard is down, so let's do Mystic Meat. Data Small, you have to heal everyone with Health Chant. And then you guys just hit the Vital Statue and hope, I guess. She has enough to use Mystic Meat, I should have done with her. She's quicker anyway. Oh, I guess Mystic Meat just goes first. survive, please. Oh, they, of course they'll survive. It only does half damage. Um, hmm. I'm trying to even think of what to do here. You attack. Uh, you detonate it. And then you burrito some snow. 
god, that's really annoying. Oh, it's nauseated. And it already wasted its turn, so it can't do that. Okay. And then he flesh leeches. That'll kill someone, though. Oh, it's very lucky that he didn't. Okay, I'm thinking now's the time for... Cosmic Procession, which does half? Yes, it does. Nice. <laughs> okay. Okay, cool. So now, normal attack. Juice pack. Normal attack. Now, I think we have enough health to survive everything. Yes. <sighs> yes. Okay, now we just need to watch out for Gibby's really dangerous attacks. Um, detonation is my biggest attack, besides Pongorma's attacks. Um... Which is partial destruction. Oh, this data is one, right. Or wait, not dissect. Detonation. Partial destruct. That'll also help us figure out how much health he actually has. Because whatever damage it does, we can multiply that by four. Um, and then just mini leech him. Okay, so it does 606 damage. Which means that he has... 1800 damage? Health left. Oh boy. Yes. Okay. Hollow Feather. Detonation. Partial destruction. Um. Now is actually a pretty good time for health chant. Because it's better, I think it's better that everyone's at full health. Oh god, Pongorm is dead. Yep. Okay, well luckily, everyone's gonna be full. Did anyone happen to see how much... I mean, no one will be able to help me. Warm Burrito Punkor. Okay, now all he has to do is survive. Doesn't look like it's gonna happen. Oh shit, our thing's down. He's gonna confuse us. Oh, but that only does half. And those are his two turns, right? <sighs> okay, yeah, those are his two turns. Um, health chant. Health chant. Mystic meat. Um, juice box. On Gorma. Perfect. This battle is going a lot better this time. Give me attacks, and he leeches flesh. So when he attacks, he just does 120 every time. Okay. Everyone's back to full. Can you even? 
even. <laughs> okay, this works. Just hit him with a normal attack. You partially destruct him. And then just regular attack. Okay. So let's see how much this does. 206. That means he only has 600 left. And it halves us. And then it halves us again. This, this is why they want you to save the hot dog. Um, and then a health chant. Um, hot dog. Man, that's useful. Get him, Pongorma. Okay, there's the 60. And then that would be the confusion and 60 for everyone. Right. I did not expect this battle to be so trying. Uh, I think Pungorma does less damage. Okay, so as long as you have Mystic Meetup, it's not so hard of a fight. <gasps> we did it! Nice. Wow. Hot dog found. Wait, is it level 63? Were we leveling up? 63. So I'm defeated. Wayne, I'm sorry about everything. God. By the way, set, I set this moon to explode when you die. Say your prayers and impede your apparels. Like delusion doom. Oh, we gotta go. Yeah, we gotta go right quick, huh? Shit, well. It didn't even occur to me that we were on a spherical planet. <sighs> There's that art of Wayne. Or Wayne, vital grimly adrift, sustains the insect besides the pungent vessel sustenance. Within the sounds, a mountain digests wrongfully. For can her government suffer near mandibles? So ends the tale of the psychic furnaces who sought to batter and sort of greatly forgetted your pungent ocean. Uh, wow. Oh, we landed on the... <laughs> we landed on the guy. <laughs> it was there the whole time. Oh, um, summon a boat? Yes. I was going to say we're stuck here and that's horrible, but they put a the little dock there and you can just summon the boat. That's nice. All right. So I'll drop it off here. And then I guess I'll go sleep in my bed and just see if anything happens. We already got shurikens, right? Or no, this is hollow pleather. Luckily, now everyone has that. Oh man. Oh no, I don't even have a bath. I, or bed, I have a bath. Oh, give roach food. Thanks for the snack, you can have this. Palmetto shield. Chitin jerky. Of course, I was so foolish. Meow. Oh, I think my cat had kittens while I was out. Cool. Um. Acquired horse. I feel like these are things I should uh, shouldn't have done so late in the game, considering I did just beat the game. <laughs> I have several, I have million dollars. 
Wow, um... I guess that's Helix, everyone. I don't know what I expected. We, uh, we've successfully cleft the moon, though. Uh, I hope everyone enjoyed that, and I think that you should buy and play this game yourself. Since, you know, you'll get a weird random plot every time, and maybe you'll be able to figure out what's going on. It seems relatively straightforward, though. I'm going to assume that Wayne and Gibby are brothers because of their shared symbolism with the moon. But yeah, um, I've been Alfred. This has been Hillix. I hope you all have a good day. See ya.